you think about me, Billy Butcher, being cast as Johnny Kite? <laughs> <laughs> so, Carl Urban in Final Talks. <laughs> to play Johnny Cage? Now, check this out, right? I love this dude. Alright? I love... I only know him from two things, though. Judge Dredd and The Boys. Loved him in both two different characters. So, I'm not exactly familiar with his full range. I don't know, is he a martial artist or not? I mean, as Billy, he looks more like um, Kano than anything. Sounds more like Kano than anything. But let's see here. Let's continue. Let's see here. He brought us Yomer, Judge Dredd, Star Trek's Dr. McCoy. I forgot he was Dr. Yo! I forgot he was! <laughs> and Billy Butcher. And it looks like soon he'll bring us a fatality. Our trusted and proven sources have delivered the incredible news that Carl Urban is in final talks to appear in the upcoming martial arts fantasy blockbuster Mortal Kombat 2. We don't know who he'll be playing in this sequel, but we know it will be a lead role. I don't know if he's Johnny Cage. He's not Johnny Cage. It could be, I guess. I never want to count anybody out because the fans, including myself, has been wrong over the years about certain castings. All things considered, Carl Urban is an interesting and unexpected choice for Mortal Kombat 2. Hollywood seems to be more sensitive these days about the subject of whitewashing casting white actors in the roles of characters who are traditionally considered to be people of color. And it could, it wouldn't seem likely Urban uh, would be cast as a character of Asian origin. When you consider the white characters in the franchise, Urban's casting could suggest the sequel is going outside the box in a big way. Well, he doesn't have to be Johnny Cage. I'm trying to think of who else was in. Mortal Kombat 2. Um, Cause I'm trying to think, listen, that first movie, that first movie sucked. And I'm not talking about the one in the 90s. That was the shit. I know it didn't age that well in certain ways, but um, um, that, that movie, uh, I mean, you know, certain parts were really cool. You know, it just felt like it was shot by different people. It just, it didn't, it didn't work, but I'm just trying to think of who they put in there. And I don't see him playing Johnny Cage, though. And I'm trying to think back to the second game and trying to think of the cast. And it was like Sub-Zero, Scorpion, Johnny Cage, Liu Kang, Kong Lao, um, Sonya, Kitana, Melina, Jade, Smoke. Shang Tsung, Shao Kahn, hmm. Motoro, hmm. Hmm. who else? Jax, hmm. I'm, I'm thinking, I am trying, I, it's been a while. I don't know who he would be. Let me see here. Um, Perhaps the hero fans are most anticipating for Mortal Kombat 2 is Johnny Cage, who Lydon Ashby played in 1995. Uh, uh, Lyndon Ash Ashby played in 1995 live action film. Carl Urban seems a little too old for the charismatic hotshot Cage. Yeah. Um, so if he, so if this is the role he'd been tapped for. It's possible the sequel is taking the character in an unexpected direction. Perhaps uh, we could be looking at an older, washed-up Cage, possibly. Then again, compared to the other actors who have 
either been rumored to play Cage or high on fans wish list, Carl Urban, who will turn 51 next month, oh, okay, uh, really isn't that old. Perhaps the name that's been rumored the most in terms of Cage casting is Charlie Hunnam of Sons of Anarchy fame, who turned 43 last month. Then there's Scott Adkins. He could definitely be Johnny Cage. Definitely. Who will turn 47 in June. And Ryan Reynolds, who will likewise turn 47. I mean, he, he could play Johnny. <laughs> he could definitely play Johnny. But I, I don't know if I could not unsee Ryan, because Ryan has a particular delivery. I don't know if he, he's not. I think... I think uh, pretty boy Scott Atkins is more Johnny Cage than um, Ryan Reynolds is. Um, of course, uh, if 2020 was Mortal Kombat had a slightly different cast of characters, our top choice for Carl Urban in Mortal Kombat would have been Kano. Exactly. He's a bit older. He's Australian, while Urban is from New Zealand, and he's even got a beard. Unfortunately, Josh Lawson um, is... Uh, not only already played Kano in the first uh, of the rebooted film series, but he played it, but he's killed by Sonya. Yes. Last June, Screen Rant wrote in. I've never seen that before. Anyway, arguing that it was a mistake to kill Kano so early in the film. Yeah, because there were only storylines in the. There were other storylines in the source material in which the villain was integral. Could it be the filmmakers took the notion to heart and tapped Carl Urban to play a resurrected Kano? Okay. Or perhaps even Kano from a different time. That would be... That wouldn't be without precedent. The 2019 game Mortal Kombat 11 had two different versions of Kano from different time periods. Okay. Alright, so what do y'all think? I don't know. <laughs> what do you think, mates? Think I could pull it off? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Like he's definitely Kano. To me, he's Kano all day long. When I'm hearing the but, you know, Billy Butcher. You know what I mean? So I don't know who he would be playing like Judge Dredd, but um, and then Scotty doesn't fit in there anywhere. <laughs> But um, he's, he's got range, so we'll see. But uh, let me know what you think. Do you want him to play Johnny Cage or not? I don't. I'd like to see him play somebody else, personally. I love him. I just, he, to me, he's not Johnny Cage. You know what I mean? 10 million subscribers. Woo!